Hello and welcome to my video. Today I'm going to be making DIY dorm decor because I have this canvas that was left on Betty's last year and some paint so and I've been watching a lot of TikToks so I'm going to paint a picture. I have it sketched out already so it's going to look like this. So it'll be like basically it's supposed to be like me and my roommate and it's going to go right here like in the middle of this wall. Um but also next year I plan on being an RA so I'll be living alone so I'm going to make it like BP themed like a duo. So one of the girls is going to be blue and one's going to be pink but then it also works like because I live in a double but that way I can reuse it again next year if I have room on my walls. Basically I'm just going to be painting this today. If you're new here, my name's Melanie and I am a junior this year at the University of Notre Dame, class of 2023. I make videos about college life, fashion, lifestyle, mostly vlogs, sometimes advice videos, um, lookbooks, etc. Just about what it's like to be in my life a student at a top university in the country. So definitely lots of fun, lots of tradition at Notre Dame. So if that sounds interesting to you, definitely click the subscribe button like the video go watch the rest of my videos have lots of videos um and yeah let's get into it i guess i'll move to my desk i was just like kind of chilling like on the floor right there i had my carpet like folded up that way um it wouldn't get paint that way it wouldn't get paint on it and it wouldn't get ruined but i'll kick it over to my desk that way i have a little bit better of a setup um so i will be I don't know if this is too dark, but this is just kind of what we're going to work with. I wish I had another camera so you could, like, watch me, but then also watch me paint. Um, so I'm going to paint the background first, and then I'll let you uh, watch me paint. So I'm going to mix red and white to paint the background, because I have, like, blue and light blue. So I'm going to use those to, like, get a dual tone on one of the shirts. And then two pinks to get a dual tone. But then my room is like pink, boho, cowboy, chic, princess vibes. So I want the background to be pink so that it matches the vibe, you know. But I don't have another pink in this set. I did have other blues, but like that just would not. Like if the majority of it's blue, it's not going to match my wall. So I figured I would just use white and red and mix them. And then I have... I have this like it's a lotion lid and then i put the plastic from the canvas on top of it and like rubber band it um and i'm gonna put the paint on here because too lazy to walk to the basement to go get a bowl like a paper bowl because i live on the fourth floor now and i'm exhausted from the past two days of moving if you haven't watched my move-in vlog um I have a move-in vlog but then i also have a move-in live stream that's still up on my channel now that i did um of just me like unpacking my room and then i also am gonna have a dorm tour up so that you can see the final product of my room because i just did a sneak peek in the move-in vlog like once it was finished and then i have this video where i'm making this piece of decor so make sure you check all that out plus all my other vlogs i have like a million of them Trying to decide which paintbrush I want to use. This one's a little bit less stiff, so I think I'm going to use this. Um, but yeah, it's been a busy past couple of days. I like, I don't know, for some reason, before I like moved in, I genuinely believed that I was going to have like just a ton of time on my hands. Hello, Grace. Hello. I'm filming a video because I'm painting this right now. Oh, okay. But I'm not going to talk forever. I'm just going to talk for a little bit while I paint the background and then I'm just going to film myself. <laughs> I did. I sent one off with Morgan. I was okay. almost going to send her... Yes. Okay, I was almost going to send her mine as a joke. <laughs> and then switch with her later. But then I was like, she'll oh, be really angry. Okay. So I was like, I'll just do... I'll she just send my own. Like, no, right? Tell. Which, it would have been so funny. Because I told Are her I was going to switch it. Yeah, she would have been stressed. But I would have thought that was hilarious. <laughs> but I did not do that. But these rocks are new. She added them. I know, I kind of like it. I feel like it makes it look more official. For the succulents, it's going to be a little bit hard That's to, like, know yeah. when they're dry, but I think they That's look pretty, cool. right? Okay. I'm going to do one blue, one pink. That okay. way, I can also use it in my I room like next year, eyes. right? Super cute. But, yeah, anyways, we were talking about our succulents that we have. Grace bought me succulents for my birthday. Can I say hi? Yeah. This mm -hmm. is Grace, my random roomie. We're a random roomie success story. 
Um, she bought me succulents for my birthday, so go watch my birthday vlog from last year. It's my 20th birthday vlog. Um, so I have those succulents. And then also go watch one of my vlogs in February. I don't think I have a... I might have a dedicated birthday vlog for Morgan. Loki, not sure yet because I haven't edited those videos yet. Um, but if you go watch that vlog, you can see the bamboo that I bought for her. Her bamboo. And then if you watch the rest of my vlogs from last semester, you can slowly hear the progress of my bamboo dying. Bamboo is one of the hardest plants to kill, but somehow I managed to knock three out of the five... Or two and a half two and like three quarters of the five stems out of my plant somehow. It's probably because like I had this little like spray bottle where I was gonna like, um, well it was essential oils from McWell, but then I cleaned it out and then I put water in it and I was gonna use it to like spray my plants, um, which just isn't smart. Just like wholeheartedly water your plants like every once in a while that just works out significantly better. Um, but anyways, I sprayed them with like diluted essential oil water essentially and then they died. So don't do that because it will kill your bamboo. But you know, I'm still two and a half stems strong so it's fine. But if you can hear fans whirring, it's because my dorm is a literal toaster oven. And I'm kind of over here away from the fans and I'm not going to bring one close to me just because it will ruin the audio. But just know I'm suffering. I'm suffering a lot right now because it's super humid. Um, it's kind of fresh outside, but the problem is our windows are like in the nooks because we're on the fourth floor, but our room's so much bigger, so it's definitely worth it because it's not going to be hot for that long, just for like the first couple weeks, um, and then it'll be fine, but I painted the background first because I thought I would like it'd be good to paint over the hair in case I got over, but now my lines are actually coming out almost perfect, so maybe I should have done the hair first, but it's fine. The hair's a darker color, so I think it should be fine. Um... Anyways, yeah, it's super hot in our dorm. It's been a really busy past couple of days. Moving was definitely brutal just because, like, four flights of stairs and carrying boxes, and I have a lot of stuff. I don't know if you can tell by watching my dorm videos um, or if you, my dad complained enough in my move-in vlog. I don't know if I got any of that on camera, but he definitely complained a lot. But my legs are literally, like, dead. And then, like, just running around. I also have, like, work orientation, which is the reason I got to move in early because of my job on campus. They're orienting us, student managers, because I got a promotion. So I got to move in early, which is really nice because this year, moving for upperclassmen was on, well, just like all classmen who are not freshmen in general, was on Sunday. And then the first day of classes is on Monday, which is like literally just so brutal. Um, so I'm glad I got to move in early, because if not, I just don't know how I would have done that. This is actually a really pretty pink color. It's coming out good so far. You can't see it. I'll give you all like... It's looking good, so definitely I think I'm gonna be happy with this. First, when I first tried like sketching these, it wasn't coming out good, but this is looking good, except I don't know how I'm gonna be able to color match it because I kind of just mix these colors together, so that's gonna be interesting because I don't have enough paint. You but, can use these tissues if you want to. Well, I have enough paint, but like I just like squeeze these no, onto this. I just mean, like, in general, you can use the tissues. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh. <laughs> okay, sounds good. Anyways. I don't know how I'm going to color match this, but that'll be an issue, like, in two seconds, because that's where I'm at right now. Um, but yeah, it's been super busy. I've been running around, so, like, when I first got here, I, like, moved in early in the morning, too, but it took me kind of a long time to unpack. It took me, like, two days, which usually I just like to do things immediately, but, like, it's just so hot, and I was just, like, really tired. Because, also, I did not get a lot of sleep because my plane got in, like, super late at night. And then we had to wait forever for a rental car because they, like, didn't have any cleaned. So, we were at the airport kind of for a long time on Tuesday, which is when I got in. Then I moved in on Wednesday. Very exhausting. Very, very, very hot. Because, like, the fans weren't even set up in the room. So, it was just, like, very miserable. And then, Thursday, which was... Today's Friday, I think. So Thursday was yesterday. Um, Thursday, I finished unpacking. And then I was like, oh, I brought way too many clothes. But then I actually made everything fit. And like this year, I feel like everything I have is much more organized than it was last year. Go watch my Tringle tour. My Tringle is literally like the cutest thing I... Well, actually, I think I like this dorm more. Because this dorm, like, it just... It's like slightly more compact than my Tringle. So it just like... 
I, I don't know, I just like it more. But my Tringle is definitely really freaking cute. So go watch my Tringle tour just to see like how much stuff I had and how it was organized. And then watch this dorm tour and like see the difference because there is definitely a difference. This year I'm just much more organized I feel like. And I really didn't condense that much. I did send some things back to storage but like not a ton. So yeah, that's like how that is. Um, But managed to make everything fit Thursday, finished up. And then I also had laser tag on Thursday with my team, so that was fun. Uh, then, uh, actually I really didn't even want to go to laser tag. <laughs> like low key, I like hate doing things that are like very involved, but then like I'm also really competitive, so then like as soon as I'm there, I'm like super into it, but like beforehand I'm like, oh my god, like I hate doing things that are super involved. So, at first I was like, mm, but then once I was there, I was like, this is so much fun. Like, I could play laser tag literally all day for the rest of my entire life. And then Friday, which was today, I had to wake up super early, which also are, like, I'm not on the dome side of my dorm this year. And I'm, like, literally so, so devastated about it. Don't ever comment anything about me not being on the dome side because I will cry. It's just, I'm so upset about it. I loved absolutely loves having a dome view it's just the most beautiful thing especially once it's fallen the trees start to die because then you can like actually see the dome and it's like just the best having a dome view and this year we do not have a dome view and so that means we're on the side of the building where the dumpsters are so every morning i get woken up by a dumpster truck taking the trash away which like it won't be every day once the school year starts it's just every day right now because i'm moving um i think this is close enough in color hopefully Ooh. It's definitely lighter, but I can't tell if it'll dry and be dark enough. I'm kind of thinking it won't. So let me go add a little bit more red. But that won't be every day once the school year starts. Also, once it gets colder and I can close my window, that'll kind of dilute the sound. But I'm just hoping like I'll get used to it because it's been waking me up for like the past two days that I've been sleeping in my dorm and it'll probably wake me up again tomorrow, which just is not any fun for me because I'm exhausted and then also I keep having like problems trying to fall asleep which I'm like really really tired so I don't know why I'm having an issue like even falling asleep because I'm exhausted but it's like as soon as I lay down in bed I'm like immediately energized so then I decorated my board in front of my door I'll put in a picture of that because it's actually it came out super super cute this is definitely like lighter but I don't know if you can really tell that much so I'm just gonna go with it honestly um my door sign oh shoot Ugh. my door sign is really cute i made it because our room is super cute and i just want people to come visit i want it to be oh, oh, dang it i keep messing up now i want it to be a social scene for people to come and sit down and stuff but since we're on the fourth floor like people don't really like wander down this hallway unless they live here so like there's just not a lot of foot traffic um, so I'm just kind of hoping my section I feel like is gonna be a really good section definitely a lot of girls who are really involved in the dorm So that should be fun. I'm just hoping people like come in stop by sit down So if you're watching this you live in my section, please come sit in my room chat with me Please I'm a very social person. I would absolutely love it. So yeah um anyways I think that's gonna go well my board's super cute my room super cute I actually really love the nooks. I keep telling myself like the space in the nooks really just make, and by nooks I mean like where my bed is. If you watch my dorm tour it'll make more sense or if you kind of like, if you saw Grace's bed in the background of parts of this, then it'll make a little bit more sense. Um, I have to be careful because I don't want to get paint on my clothes. But I keep telling myself like that definitely makes it worth it. It's only a semester because I'll be gone in the spring. I won't be here, I'll be in Europe. So that'll be a lot of fun for me then. Also super kind of sad about going away in the spring just because I like genuinely love it here and I only have a year and a half left on campus, which is basically what I've had because of COVID. Um, so that like mildly upsets me just a little bit. And, but I think it's gonna definitely be worth it. Everyone loves their study abroad experience. So I don't regret signing up for study abroad. This paint's actually drying really fast, like faster than I thought it would, which is good. And the color matches pretty well. So you really cannot tell the difference. Um, I just hope I don't get paint on this dress because I actually really do love this dress. It's the dress I bought for my 19th birthday, which I do have a vlog for that as well. If you want to go watch it, it's on my channel, 19th birthday vlog. Um, okay, background, done, painted, 
well, these are a little splotchy. Anyways, I painted all of, like, I took one, like, like those I painted that, like, paint classes. But if the lighting in here is so horrible, I'm sorry. I broke my ring light during move-in, so I just am going to have to buy another one. But also, I'm saving so that I can study. Oh, so that I can travel when I study abroad. So not like a super huge priority for me right now, just because. Okay, it's done, this part, so that looks good. Um, But yeah, I think I'm gonna stop talking now because I'm just gonna film myself paint the rest of this and that's gonna play while I talk because this was 16 minutes long. So I'll just like cut that to a speed of however long is necessary for me to have this fill in 16 minutes. But Thanks for listening to me talk. Thanks for watching. Make sure you watch my vlogs this semester. My goal is to just put out a lot of content, like, very consistently. Um, so I'm going to, like, block in time. I'm taking six classes and also working for or 10 hours a week for my on-campus jobs. So I'm definitely a very busy person, but I'm going to block in time for me to edit vlogs so that I can hopefully stay more consistent this semester because that's something I do just hate. Like, I film so much, and then I don't edit it because I don't have time, and then I just, like, run out of time constantly. So I... Oh, I missed a spot. I'm hoping that I can really just stay on track with YouTube this year because I would love for things to just go up in like more real time. Definitely look out for some more lives. I plan on doing lives like pretty frequently this year. You can go on and ask me questions if you have any questions. Um, I just feel like lives are super easy because it's no editing involved. Um, so I plan on doing those a lot just to kind of like fill in content gaps. But yeah, thanks for watching. Um, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Please comment any questions you have. Just comment on my videos, like my videos, subscribe to my channel, follow me on Instagram, follow me on TikTok. Um, DM me if you have questions, come to my live and ask questions. And I will see you in the next one. Thanks for watching.